All right. Well, let's try another arena fight with... This is an interesting combo. So I've seen a lot of Venom with Brotherhood teams. You know, they drop like Sabretooth or something and they put Venom in. But this one has Ultron and Phoenix. And it's a six red star Venom <laughs> a five red star Juggernaut. Uh, Phoenix is tier 13 with a few orange abilities. And Ultron is completely maxed, just like mine. 54, 183 is tier 13 with all four uh, abilities maxed. And then his Magneto is pretty tough, too. Uh, 49k. Uh, he's only 5-star, though, but uh, still nothing to ignore. Um, so this has been my uh, normal, t you know, kill everything combo. Um, let's see. I think... Oh, how do we attack this? Venom potentially extending the Magneto ult at the beginning, but that won't really matter too much because Phoenix will just take it away. Um, so obviously Guardians wouldn't work against this team because they would go to uh, the turn order wouldn't work because they go before Phoenix, or at least uh, Rocket does. But eh, I don't think I can just use my standard kill team here. So this is what I've been doing. Because um, I still think Ultron's the most important to kill. Um, oh, you know what I would say? <sighs> Let's see. If the Juggernaut is next to, what's her face, Phoenix. Hmm. And that should let me, yeah, I can just, I mean, yeah, let's just disrupt um, Ultron. So this is interesting because it's going to bring everybody together. Which means Venom's attacks are going to do a lot of damage. Um, I'm not sure. Let's see, that Juggernaut. I don't really need to worry about him too much. I might as well just go for the Ultron and get him killed as easily as possible. Ooh, almost got him there. Uh, but actually, you don't want to kill Ultron until after Phoenix goes. Because otherwise, the Disrupt will not be there. Alright, so we'll kill him maybe with the... Eh, he's got too much health for this. But we're going to ability block him so that he doesn't call in his minions. And you'll see here in a sec why. This is the perfect starting combination to uh, kill Ultron to start. He has no health now. Uh, so any AoE damage to kill him, which will be Vision's ult. And uh, basically we're just going to do what we can to get rid of him. Um... We'll go ahead and throw that extra buff on Ultron so he gets a little more energy when he does his ult. And now we will reveal whoever does not resist. That's good. And let's see. She is blind still, so we can't use that. We'll just use her basic, and hopefully she'll die here in a sec. All right, let's go ahead and kill Ultron with the ult. He'll come back, but he is going to use his ult next turn, provided he is not ability blocked. And now we can use our vision ult and kill phoenix and now we need to focus phoenix as soon as possible there goes ultron he's gone um this uh will steal a little health it might kill magneto yep very nice all right now it's kind of uh just a war to see who can kill each other's phoenix first and i think that should be fine nothing wrong with that we'll get a little health here get rid of that juggernaut and now we just focus fire on Phoenix put the offense down on her will help just in case she does get her ult off. Um, Venom was still blind from the Magneto ult there and that should murder her. Alright, there we go. So that one. Um, this setup, let me explain a little bit about this. Hey, we got some time anyway. Um, two minutes, 45 seconds of playing. So let me, let me explain a couple things. So I've been putting Mystique next to Phoenix because bringing in Magneto means that she's going to start with an evade. So that means if the enemy has a vision and they ability block or tries to ability block Phoenix, which they will because that's the only target available at that time for vision, the splash damage from his uh, ability block or the chance to land that second ability block will most likely try to hit uh, Mystique and she will avoid it because of that evade. And um, that's really helpful. Uh, Magneto also goes um, before them. So I think that extends her buff one. Um, so I'm pretty sure she'll have two evade. And then you're just trying to keep that stack rolling uh, every time Magneto gets a turn. Uh, assuming you have his passive uh, upgraded and all that. Um, then the other thing that I do off of a bat is disrupt with Magneto on whoever you want to kill first. So that could be Minerva, uh, Ultron or whatever. 
I focus Ultron, even if there is a Minerva. And the reason why is because if I can ability block him turn one, he will not call in minions. The next turn, he will always have his ult charged. And as long as he's not ability blocked or stunned, he's going to waste his ult. He's not going to get much energy out of it because he won't have too many buffs. And uh, it just totally ruins the enemy Ultrons. So if Ultron is the reason you're losing the arena matches, Vision plus Magneto plus one Brotherhood is the way to go and then bring your own Ultron or bring your own Phoenix or whatever else you got to, to murder the other team that I think I think honestly you probably wouldn't even need Ultron if you can you know ruin their Ultron turn uh, I think a really good uh, Colossus could probably replace him because uh, he'll he'll provide a lot of cover for your damage dealer so that they can clean up everything else but that's my turn order for killing an arena when I see Ultron plus Phoenix and it works so well um, I love using Mystique as the second Brotherhood instead of Juggernaut because she doesn't provide quite as much damage, but she gets rid of stealth. And I'll say she gets it rid of it more reliably than my Falcon does. So my Falcon's only like 39k right now, so I'm still working on him. But I'll say Mystique, to me, is more reliable at getting rid of those stealths. So I think that's a really important combo. But if you're doing Arena and you're having trouble, I would say try some combination of what I got there. If you don't have all these characters built, um, you just need to find an ability block <laughs> that goes between the Phoenix uh, stealth and... Uh, like and and won't be susceptible to blind so you need yeah you need it to go after the phoenix stealth so that she removes blind so that's that's how that works your phoenix will remove the magneto blind from your vision so that he can run his uh, ability block and hit the disrupted ultron and that just nullifies ultron and it works so well so i just wanted to point that out i think that's really important uh if you think you got a better attack team than this let me know because I can kill everything with this team. I don't need to change it. It is unbeatable so far from what I've seen. I, I really haven't seen a defense that can beat it. So if you got something, uh, let me know. Otherwise, uh, I would say build this team because right now it's the anti-meta team. It is the meta killer, <laughs> which is Phoenix Ultron and whatever, three hobos. So uh, yeah, let me know if you got any ideas. Otherwise, uh, yeah. See ya.